morning. I'm very, very delighted to have you here. Good morning, Rania. Thanks for having me. Can you me. be kind enough and introduce yourself and tell me exactly what you do for the African Development Bank? Thank you, Rania. So my name is Olufunsha Shumari. I'm the regional principal officer in charge of climate change and green growth for the African Development Bank within the East African region, which covers 13 countries. And within that context of that work, I support the mainstreaming of climate change in all operations and policies of the bank in these 13 countries. But in addition as well, given the primacy of climate finance, I support the work around pipeline development, the whole range of work around assets, climate finance assets, both for bank projects, but also supporting capacity building in member countries. Yes. Can you tell me uh, why you are here today? Well, um, so this COP is a special COP. Uh, some call it the African COP, uh, others call it the Implementation COP. <laughs> or whatever it is that you call it. The Action COP. It is the action <laughs> and it's very relevant for Africa. Uh, for me, the number of topics that are of interest within this COP, we're looking for decisions around the just transition, around mitigation, around finance and around adaptation. But the one of them, the key one for me, is on adaptation. And I'm hoping that we can have some very concrete decisions on adaptation. Okay. Can you tell me why exactly is funding, as far as adaptation is concerned, so crucial for Africa? I have to say this. So um, we've heard over and over again these things about Africa didn't cause a problem. But I think what we haven't emphasized enough is that Africa, we, the continent that didn't cause a problem, is the most vulnerable to the problem. However, these countries in Africa are already spending a huge portion of their money in responding to the problem. And with the scale of the challenge they have to deal with, it's important that they get adequate and additional support. So in Africa, our response to climate change, our adaptation program has to be at scale and it has to be combined with speed. So Africa is scale and speed and that's why financing is the key component of that equation. In order to do scale and at speed, we need financing. And beyond what countries are spending themselves, you know, you will hear things like um, five to ten percent of the GDP is the cost of adaptation. Basically, it also tells you that up to fifteen billion dollars annually is being spent by African countries on responding. But that is not enough. It's nothing compared to the scale of the need. And at this call, this action call. We're hoping that we can then activate what we need to do to scale up the financing that we need for adaptation on the ground. I was listening this morning to the head of state of uh, the Congo, and he was saying that um, as far as funding is concerned, sometimes they have doubts. They don't know how they're going to be, you know, how the money is going to be spent. So how do we make sure that this money, if it comes, that it comes to the right person, to the farmer? Right, and that's a very good question because. We don't just talk about the supply of capital, we must also talk about the ability to utilize the capital and to be accountable for the capital and then to make sure the capital flows down to the people because adaptation is happening at the local level. And so what we have done uh, within the African Development Bank um, is to create the institutional mechanisms through the project and build our designs, our project pipeline through a bottom-up approach. So every project that is in our pipeline has gone through a deeper level of engagement with the beneficiaries. So most projects, the traditional way of developing projects is you've got few people who sit down and say, we need this for the rest of the country. But the approach we've taken is to start from the ground level, talk to people, help them aggregate the projects together, and go through the screening that we need and be able to package it well and also involve them in the implementation of the project. And that's what the Africa Adaptation Acceleration Program uh, in partnership with the Global Center on Adaptation is about. Pushing that bottom-up approach in the design but also making sure that the beneficiaries of the project are very much involved in the design and in the implementation of the project. And that is the only way you can guarantee success of the project and also to make sure that the money reaches the people who need it most. Thank you very much indeed. That Thank was you a very much, Rene, for you. having Thank me. Thank you. Thank you.